Welcome to Guess the Elo. This is episode number five, and it's a series where I take my Twitch subscriber games, I analyze them blindly on stream, and then I try to guess their rating. If you want to participate in the series in the future, make sure you are a Twitch subscriber and a member of the Discord. Please, and I ask you kindly, stop emailing me your games and stop DMing me your games on Instagram. There's one way to do this. Everyone's done it. You want to get in on the video, you got to do it too. Let's get into the games. All right, Gotham Sub is white in the first game. E4, E6. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Gotham Sub. You know they're a Gotham Sub. They have the E6, B6 course. They have the E6, B6 course. Link in the description. Twitch, use the courses command. Yes. Bishop, B4. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. I just re-recorded this today. This is chapter one of the E6, B6 course. Take it. Take it and take the pawn. Take it. Okay. I mean, the entire point is to win this pawn, but... Okay, that's fine. D6 is not a bad move. I mean, literally the whole point is to... Okay. Okay, so with these last two moves... Um... Um... This is not good. This is, this is bad. This is bad development because you haven't punished White's setup at all. And you put your knight in front of your bishop, which is not good. So bishop g5. Oh yeah, let's turn off the music. Bishop g5. Queen e7. No! See, this is why, in the e6-b6 system, you need to be fast. You need to punish the opponent for making blunders. Because here's what happens. You get pinned, and you're pinned, and what does white do when something is pinned? They're going to play this. They're going to play this. They're going to play e5. Uh, and then they're going to attack your knight, because it's pinned. At this point, probably the best move is to just go h6. Yeah, see, black... Needs to go h6 to kick out the bishop, or black needs to stop e5. Black did like a movie moment, you know? It's like they, they were at gunpoint, so they press their forehead into the... You know what I mean? It's like one of those gangster moments. The problem is, in this case, it's not going to end very well. Because they just get, uh, you know, they just, uh, they just lose a piece. So this is not good. At this point, black is losing. Castle's queenside. I like this move. Queen e2. Nice. Nice. Queen d6. Okay, so the problem with queen d6... Oh my god, I have a prediction for how this game ends. I have a prediction. White forks them. Queen d5 takes one of the rooks and gets mated. Oh my god. Okay, never mind. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> Oh no! Oh no, I knew it! Oh my god, I had a horrible feeling! Oh, Black with the comeback! What a comeback for Black! Oh, this is very bad. Oh, this is a very bad game by everybody involved. Both players should just... Cancel the premium membership, I mean, okay, so... I think the players are over a thousand. Definitely over... Ah, uh, actually, I think maybe like just over a thousand. 1100 is the absolute ceiling. White actually played pretty well, but when when White blunders this, you know you need to you need to take on e4. This is this is e6 b6 chapter one because when you don't do it, you get a very passive position and you don't play knight f6 if they can play e5. That's the whole point. So, right again, Black misses this. You know what? Hmm. But Black made a comeback. You know, Black played a couple of very very logical moves. So Black did long castle, which I really like. And one thing that worked here for black is that when you're losing, you need to create an attack. You need to create chaos, right? Which is what black did. So, um... Right? This was good. And now, uh... Flu Street, did you blunder this? Oh, I'm asking, I don't know if you're in the chat. But did you blunder this? And then you got, like, a little bit lucky? You were like, okay, I'm gonna go here? Because you know if white stops mate, you're just losing a rook. So... If white just prevents checkmate, and this is why you always need to look for checks, and this bishop is a killer in a lot of these positions. Right, so this bishop is a killer on this diagonal. But, uh, yeah, I guess white just didn't see it. Um, I'm gonna say between 8 and 900 is my estimate for rating. Um, so, let's see. We're gonna look together. Okay, chat? We're gonna look together. Okay, we're gonna go to big window capture. We're currently on, on uh, Gotham Chess. It's currently my, my profile page. I'm going to click the next tab. The next tab is the game. Okay? Boom. 
Oh, a thousand. Yeah, as as I said, uh, one thousand was eleven hundred was the ceiling in this game. Definitely the ceiling. It felt like so. I was my first instinct was right, but I I, I backtracked. So yeah, I guess I, I guess I'm wrong. I'm wrong because I did say between eight and nine hundred. But I, but I did say you know when, when you you need to punish in the opening. You need to punish in the opening. So this is just an openings review because you got a losing position on move ten. Think about this, my friend. You spent forty to well. And if it's on sale, 20 20 to $60 on my course, depending on when you got it. And you're losing in nine moves? No, 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 no. Not good. This is not good. It's time to go back. It's time to review. Um, and uh, if you have the Hikaru Flare, you know, Hikaru is not going to be losing in nine moves. So your Flare is Hikaru. So go back, review, the review, review, review. That's all this is. This is just review. Just review is what this is. Takes time, repetition. I like how White gets a 91 and hangs mate. Crazy. No, 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 no. This is... Come on, man. No, what is this? 91. Stop, stop, computer. They, they, they lose like 50% of points just for that. Okay. Back to uh, overlay. Um, second game. Black has... Uh, Black is the uh, uh, subscriber. E4C6. Beautiful stuff. Okay. Against this, you know, Karakhan is weird, but I say two pawns in the center. Two pawns in the center. Oh, not this. No, 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 no. Because now your bishop is blocked. Your bishop is blocked. I don't like this. Okay. This is now the exchange variation of the Karakhan, except white hasn't moved their bishop. <laughs> I mean, cannot move their bishop. Okay. So, of course, this cannot be a good opening. White just moved their deep on two times. I mean, why did they move their deep on two times? Hopefully, it was a mouse slip. You know, you have to go, you have to go d4. So, you can tell white doesn't quite know the opening. Now, black, I like, I like this. Please, I sw if one of you takes these knights unprovoked, y'all lower rated players. I hate when y'all do that, man. Good. Nice. Okay. Now is where we are going to learn a lot about these players. Okay, that's a good that's that's a decent move, but it immediately loses control of the center. Nice. 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 Push it. Oh, oh wait. Excuse me. If you push in queen takes bishop, you have this with an attack like this. But okay, I don't I don't hate this great great game. Okay, e4 is not a bad move. E4 is not a bad move. Uh, to attack the queen, but you know, I see the king go this way. What do I, I gotta put my rook put the rook on the same line e4 is not a bad move though Oh <gasps> black is winning. How's black winning? How's black winning you can take But checks captures attacks. We don't have any checks. Well, the only check that we have is a capture so and then attack How can we attack black one of white's most powerful pieces? That's just how you have to think about it. What's worth more look knight h5 boom it's not going to be the best move in every position, but in this case, it forks. Black didn't see that. Uh, I think 1500 sees that. So I think about 11 to 1400 now. I don't, I don't hate this move. Takes, takes. Okay, now black is messing up. One wrong move. You had to find e3 with the bishop and the queen opening up. Wow. And white is back in the game. Black got passive. And now, oh no, oh no. Oh, actually, no, 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 wait a minute, this rook is trapped. This rook is trapped, no? Bishop d5? Oh, but then rook c3, never mind. I love this. Take what the... What is that? What... What is this? Why? You have queen, rook, knight, you move king? Why are you moving king? You have queen, rook, and knight, why are you moving your king? Oh my god, I mean, see, computer finds only one way to save this. Queen f6, threatening mate, so I take your, your piece, and it's a draw. This is just a draw. Check, check, and it's... Actually, no, apparently black is... How is black losing? What? What if I just go back? <gasps> I can do geometric checks! Oh my god, I have geometric checks! And then I can, I can win your rook. Oh, I move my... My queen in such a way that, wow, savage. So the best move for black is not to take, it's to take the pawn. Crazy. Wow. So what happens? Okay, black just wins all the pieces. That's what happens. Okay, and white just doesn't... Okay. Is geometric check an actual chess term? No, it's, but, but it, it's like a lot of the terms that I say. Danger levels is not a chess term. On my danger levels video, people were gatekeeping the term. They were like... 
Go fam, this is just a Zwischenzug in a fancier term. It's like, bro, like, the whole point is to make it accessible and easy to understand. That's how you have to think about it. And a little technique to shuffle with your queen, the geometric. Wow, uh, that game, wow. I think, I think this is a game, um... I think the opening white played like a 1,100. I think they're over a thousand for sure. I think white made one really bad decision, which honestly could have even been a, a slip. I think black played at least like a 13, 1400. And white... Uh, yeah, it could have also been time trouble. Like, that's the other thing. We don't know. So I'm going to say 1300. All right, let's go have our reveal. Let's go to big window. This is the other game. Let's see. Oh my god, I was right. 1300. 13, 1400. And, and it was a time crunch. And it was a time crunch. Wow. I was right. 13, 1400. Wow. Yeah, that was good. Yeah, it felt, it felt like... Um, it, it felt like it. It felt like it. It felt like Black knew what... And, and, and it makes sense now that later in the game, you know, they played like they were 100. It's because... Yeah. How much time did Black have when they... Right, so, I mean, White had uh, 15 seconds. So, White had 15 seconds. Very bad time management by White for a 5-minute Blitz game. This was a 5-minute game, right? What? Wait. White had that little time? Oh my god. That's, that's not good. No, that's bad. No, 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 no. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. You had two minutes here. White spent 20 seconds on Queen H4. No, but see, black is crazy. I mean, of course you're about to get hit here, right? You have to play H5, man. Like, you cannot spend 30 seconds on your only move. You know what I mean? Now look, white spent... No, but this is crazy. 151. Half the time, basically, on this move. What is this? Like... That's what people don't realize. Like, I understand it's, it's really difficult. And, and trust me, I have, I have my own problems with nerves. But you cannot spend 51 seconds on pawn to h3. Like, bad time management. If I'm going to teach you anything from this video that I make, or this stream that we're doing, no, this is too much. Too much time. Too much time. Play faster. You just force yourself to play faster. Because look, black is down 35 seconds on the clock here. If, and white lost this game because of time. White went from 151 to 34 seconds on the clock in two turns. No, but you can't listen. No, no, no. This is this is bad. This is this is this is bad. Um, this is bad. And I have my own problems with time trouble, obviously. But my problem is, you know, I get I get very nervous, and uh, that's my that's that's my issue. So do as I say, not as I do. And if you get nervous, well, then I can't help you. That I have not figured out the answer to just yet. Okay. D4, D5, bishop f4, knight c6. Okay, immediately, this is an under 1500 game. Nobody above 1500 should be playing knight c6. Knight f3, bishop g4, e3, e6. So far, so good. I like this. Now, if this person had the Gotham d4 dynamite repertoire, they would know that against knight to c6, what we do is we play c4. That's what we do. Play c4. When this bishop is out, c4, knight c3, and queen to b3. That's what we do. We go for a queenside pawn hunt. But this person doesn't have the Gotham d4 dynamite course. And that is why they play like this, which is fine. This is good. I don't like that. I hate that move. Go knight d2. In fact, h6 is a big blunder. h6 is a big blunder. Why? Black needs to go bishop to g6. I'm saying you should be able to play bishop to g6 and take with your h-pawn because then your pawn structure stays together. If you play the move h6, then I can play g4 now. And this is a big plus for me. Notice black has a big advantage. Uh, sorry, white has a big advantage because when this happens, I'm going to take take. And look what I've done to your structure. This is misery. This is miserable. Absolutely miserable. You've, you've split the pawns. I can go queen d3. Now the only way to protect this is either to push it and allow me to check you or play king f7. So you cannot, you cannot 
play h6 here. You need the h pawn to support the g6 square. Okay? Black, white plays queen c2. Okay, okay. Good. You didn't just take. If you just take, I mean, the, well, white is already in an equal position, but I like this. Ooh. Very interesting. Nice. Castle. 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 Good. Okay. Interesting position. What was the best move? Oh, computer is a savage. Look at this. Bishop takes f4. Pawn t Wait, I don't understand. And what if I go here? Ah, of course, of course, of course, of course. Bang, bang, and bang. The two loose pieces in white's position go to two loose friends. Wow. Wow. Thank you, by the way, Hokey Joe, for the sub gifts. Trying not to shout out too much, breaking the fourth wall here, but uh, we're also recording this for YouTube, so mad love for y'all. Um, wow. Huge sacrifice there, so you block it up. I love it, I love it. No! Wait a minute. Well, actually, it's fine. They're both good. I just realized that um, taking on e5 loses either way. I apologize. But I thought it was much better to take with the f-pawn because you open up the f-file for your rook. I would have 100% taken with the, with, with the f-pawn there, but d takes is also good because I just realized that the rook is being lost. So I apologize for yelling. I just immediately, you know, panicked. Uh, I'm getting back seated, so let me please strike down a pleb. A pleb said that uh, in this position, after bishop takes f4, pawn takes f4, queen f4, knight d2, rook g1, rook g1, queen e3, they said bishop a6, save the bishop. It does not, because taking the rook is check. So you always have to make sure your king is under attack or not. Yes? Also very important not to backseat the computer. You can backseat me, I'm a human, but don't backseat the computer. Whoa. But why not just take the horse? Fine. I don't hate it. Now take the horse. Good man. Take. Take. How do you win a position when you're up a bishop? That's one way. Two ways. One way is to go to an endgame. Trade everybody, go to an endgame. The other way, use your bishop and hunt down the, the, the king. So rook d6? Oh, that's mate. Back rank mate. Nice. That was a great game. I think white is like... You know what's interesting? White made a couple of inaccuracies. So to be honest, white can actually be like... I think white is like 12, 1300. That's what I would say. Uh, I would say white is like 13, like 13, 1400, I would say. Because a couple of things. White uh, is, I think, 15, 1600. You're already adding layers to your London at that level. I think like 15, 1600. Like... You're adding a few layers. And what I mean by that is, you know, when you study the London, buy the London course. Use the command courses, Twitch chat. Link in the description on YouTube. You know that you go C4. So you start adding layers to your game. You're not just playing. See, what White did is White played this in the, in the same way they think they're supposed to play this, which makes me think that they're like 1300, like 12, 1300. Because at that stage, you're still kind of getting out into the... And h6 is a very not good move. It's a very not good move. So I'm inclined to think... Like, also, knight h5 is a bit of a strange move. Like, why? Why knight h5? Like, why? Why? Um, then white played very well. I wouldn't go queen d3. I think here the best move is easily to castle or break in the center. Oh, very tough. I'm gonna say between... Oh, it's either 12 to 13 or 13 to 1400. If you're lower than that, you played fantastic game. If you're higher than that, God help you. Um, okay, I really need to kind of dig into the moves here. I think G5 is a great move by Black, by the way. So that actually, this makes me think it's a game. Black is like 1400, the fact that Black played G5. Actually, G5 is a huge move. But missing Bishop takes F4, and it's not so bad, actually. But missing the fact that your Rook is lost? 12 to 1300. I think 12 to 1300. That's my final answer. Let's go see. There is a chance it's 13 to 1400. It's in that 100 gap. Here we go. Here we go. We're here. Okay. 13, 1400. But white got a 95% score. Ah, I hit my funny bone. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. Ah. Hit my funny bone on my chair. Ah. <laughs> okay, it's, it stopped rattling. Okay. So, yeah, I went with 12 to 1300, but uh, they were high 1300s, or just 1300s. Okay, yeah, as I said, this person is probably not 1400, because, and I'm curious what their blitz rating is. 
I guess they don't play a lot of Blitz. It's fine. Yeah, it, it, it felt like a very good game by White. Black made one very big blunder. It was a good game. But you can always sell in the opening. So these guys, I think they need to get their openings a bit better. You're 1400 now. Okay, so they're 1400, yeah. They're 1400. Um, but I was, tw I, I thought 12 to 1300 because the opening was shaky. Very, very, too shaky of a London. I think if you're 1400, then you have the capacity to really bump up your London play. Like playing C4 when the light squared bishop comes out, for example. Like stuff like that. But that was a good game. It was a good game, honestly. V very, very nice game. For this next one, uh, Gotham Sub is playing with the black pieces. This is also a London. That's, that, that's all. You're just learning a London? Well, then it shows. Yeah. And I'm not saying that in an insulting way. That was a good game. So, I honestly... The, the, the middle game you played, like, what you got, you played, like, easy 14, 1500. But the opening was a bit shaky, it felt like. So, once you get the opening good, you know... Um, okay, Dutch. Okay. Okay, very bad move, of course, because d5. Nice. Okay, more bad moves. Good. But this is not a bad move. Um, let the fun begin. Black in this position either has to go for the bishop, play like this, or go for e5. Or put the knight in the center. Let's see what happens. Okay. What is this? Why? This makes me think that the person playing with white is like... At most, 1100. Maybe, maybe 1200. You know why? People who are beginners, when they go like this, right? And they, and they, and they, they're like, oops. And bishop g5, they say, oh, it's a pin. I can pin. It must be a good move. That's what they do. They say, oh, pin. Oh. Or they say, oh, I can attack the rook. So when you're a beginner, you go, oh, I just learned about this. I'm going to do it. Don't do it. Bishop g5 is not a very good move. You just get attacked. Is that what happened? It's another person who just bravely walks closer into a pin. Okay, I mean, what is this? Guys, no, 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 no. Oh, yes, beautiful, you beautiful, beautiful, beautiful stuff. Yes, yes, yes. And look at what the computer wants after pawn takes d5. Computer doesn't want you to take back. It wants you to bam, in between move hitting the knight, and then you take back. And if they take... You take, and if they take, you take, and if they queen, you take their queen with check. Of course. Good. Very good. Okay. Bam, 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 bam. Yo, white is killing me, man. Look. Queen c3 check. White is not, is losing this game by not castling. Because now, if queen d2, I take the rook. Great move, by the way. Excellent move. Like, white should just castle. Just shut up and castle. Don't even ask questions. Just castle. But why does too obsessed with attacking the queen? And now check. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Please tell me you played this move. No, but what is this? No, but what is this? Come on. I mean, come on, man. Like, I, like for once in chess, you need tunnel vision. You need tunnel vision. You, like, just get a little bit of tunnel vision. I mean, the knight is there. Bam. Do you realize how strong this move is? Do you realize how strong this move is? Number one, pressure here. So the threat is take. They can't take because you take the rook. Number two, this. Number three, bishop teams up with the queen. Oh my. Oh my. Yeah, I, of course, computer is like minus one because of some ridiculous computer defense. But if they don't find rook c1, queen a5, b4, sacrificing the pawn, and then a3, sacrificing another pawn to deflect the queen away from the knight, and now you take... Like, come on. Come on, guys. This is, this is crazy stuff. Like, no one's gonna find that. Like, the computer wants you to you use pawn sacrifices to deflect the queen, because, look at this, because... Oh my god, if you don't take this, if you just make... Bing? Bang. That's what the computer wants. It sacrifices the pawn, and if you don't take the second one to try to maintain the pin, it goes here. I mean, this is why computers are ridiculous. Because they just find these completely insane... I mean, uh, come on. Silly stuff. Very silly stuff. But bishop d7 is atrocious. Please castle. Oh, thank god. Now, now, one move, and it's back in the game. Knight e4. Please. Oh no, oh no. Did, he, did, did white actually find queen d5? Oh... 
and this bishop, which was played on the move that black could have won the game, is the reason why black loses. So white found a nice little removing the guard tactic. This is why you always look for your opponent's forcing moves while you look for your own. You know, because black did this. Black said, I'm going to go here, I'm going to take this pawn. But black did not think, what if they take to remove the defender of my pawn here, right? So I, I, I sound harsh, but this is educational. Yeah, and now you lose everything. Crazy. Unbelievable. Heartbreaking game. Yeah, and white just immediately brings in the... Well, I mean, look, the simple thing is just take the queen, right? Just take the queen. Just take the queen, man. Good. Rook to the middle. Knight to the middle. You can even sacrifice there. Yeah, gobble, gobble, gobble. Push, 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 push. Good conversion here. Yo, this guy pushed his d pawn to d7 and then never made a queen. Bro. Hello? Oh, he's just trolling. Okay. This is just trolling. Uh-huh. Okay. It's a stalemate. It's a stalemate. It's a draw. Oh my god. Oh my god, because the queen is covered. Oh my god. 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 This was... There, there was like check. You could have at least queen... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, that's inexcusable. No, no, no. That's inexcusable. If this is a rapid game, if white had any more than 30 seconds on the clock here, any more than 30 seconds, white is, white is done. Delete the chess account. That's it. Checkers, poker, bridge. Oh my god. Oh my god. I mean, that's what white deserves, first of all. Oh my god. I mean, I honestly don't know. I, it felt like a... It felt like a... Let's put it this way. I think anybody rated 1200 could have played all of these opening moves. Maybe even 13, 1400, honestly. But, and, I mean, up until this point, Black is playing easily like 15, 1600 chess. Easily. Not finding knight e4 docks you four, 400 points, honestly. Like, I, I think to me, like, you go from 15, 16, like, easily. Because 15, 1600 is seeing a pin, and immediately their brain is like, how do I put pressure here? And it's knight e4, and you win the game. You don't play bishop d7. You see that after knight e4, you have three threats. That's what I think. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna say that uh, this was a game played between 1,000 to 1,100 chess players. This is my prediction. Let's go. I think 1,000 to 1,100. And if it's anything high, at mo the absolute ceiling is 1,200. If it's anything above 1,200, I'm very upset. If it's 11, high 11, I'm okay with that. But anything above 1,200, this is not good. This is not, this is, this, this is not okay. Like, this, something is wrong. Okay, here we go. Oh! Yeah. 900. Wow. So there you go. That actually, that, that, that actually makes... That, that actually... I'm incredibly impressed with Black's play. I think Black has some serious potential. Uh, you, played, you played incredibly. See, I could tell very early that White... I'm not even paying attention to White's play because White got this bishop here, hit with few tempo, you know, pin just because they can, don't castle. White played like 1,000 tops. Black played an excellent game. So, Graditz, you should be very proud. Because um, I was saying 1,000 to 1,100. Um, look how much time White had left at the end. Let me see. Ah, well, White has a minute. I mean, white has a minute. I mean, white is not losing any time. White is just trolling here. No, this is inexcusable. White spent seven seconds. White spent seven seconds on that move. They spent the most amount of time on that move in the last like 10 moves. Oh God, oh, um, get this out of, no, 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 awful game. No, 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 white needs to go for a siesta. They're from Spain, it's time for a siesta. Guy with the black pieces, listen, you played fantastic game of chess, man. That was excellent stuff from the opening. Okay, and uh, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? It's a three minute game and you played like that in the opening? You played like that in the opening, man? Oh no, you have potential, man. You have some serious potential. What's your rapid? 1250? And what's this guy's rapid? Wow. 1257 rapid. <gasps> okay, next game. We're gonna forget this game happened. No, 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 but I mean, Graditz, you, you, have, you have serious potential, man. You, you, played, you played a great game, man. I mean, the guy with white needs to take a break. Play checkers, I mean, something. No, no, no. Wow, wow, wow. That was... Pfft, embarrassing. That was very bad. Having said that, having said that, having said that, 
white stabilized, and white found bishop takes knight, queen takes pawn. Listen, chat, I need to be nice to my subscriber. My subscriber played black, okay? The other guy, I don't know who he is, okay? I'm being rude because the other guy is not part of the Gotham community. If the other guy was part of the Gotham community, I would be nice to the, goth the guy from, you know. Plus, also, I'm not being so nice. I'm, I'm, I'm you know, listen, you gotta be a hard coach. If coach tells you everything you want to hear, you just say, oh, okay, great, I'm so smart. Listen, you have to be told you're doing things wrong, but in the right way. So, unless he played someone in the chat and I just insulted somebody in the chat. So, okay, here we go. E4, D5, Knight F3. Okay, so either white is a genius and white saw my video called uh, Tennis and Gambit Intercontinental Ballistic Missile Variation, which is a real thing. Definitely go watch that YouTube video. Or white just hung a pawn. So let's see what happens. So white plays, black plays here. Okay, so uh, white clearly did not watch my video. Because um, that is not what you do. You go here to try to win the pawn back. Black plays F. Okay, so um, I'm going to try to be as nice as possible. Um, because black might be a beginner. You know, I don't want to kill black's hopes and dreams. Already white is winning. This is why you always have to look for checks. The f-pawn moving in openings weakens your king. And queen to h5 wins the game on the spot. Because after g6, you take, take queen h8. So this tactical pattern opening up with queen and knight, or queen and bishop, um, you gotta know at least if you're 800. So I already think below 800. Black needs to just learn some openings. I mean, to be honest, black got tricked, man. Like, black got tricked, you know? They, they played this, and then they were like... What's this guy doing here? Let me, it's like, don't do stuff like this. You cannot weaken your king. Just get the knights out. Get the bishop out. Play in the middle. And, uh... What? Yeah, I'll move late. Okay, so... That's a, okay. Um... Okay, good. But they just defended it. But they just defended it. No, no, but what about the other... What about... Like, you could... What? Okay. Um... It's white... Did, like, white, like, lose this game on purpose? And, like, send in a game, like, where they played terribly on purpose or something? I don't... What? Is that, is that what white... Or, or, or is white... Is white just, like, a total beginner? Uh, no, 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 free, 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 free. No. Yes. No. Yes. What? I like how Rook F8 here is a good move. Oh my god, they found it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, this looks like a bullet game. Um, because it's, unless White resigned here. But this, I, I have no clue. I mean, probably about 500, like five, 600. Um, is what? Oh, my food is here. One second. All right, yeah, we got, we got our food. I'll cut this part out of the YouTube video though. Um, let me let me message my girlfriend. Okay, Lucy's on it. We have a good system here. What do we get? We got a lot of food. Um, so, let's go. Chat, I don't know. What do we think? 500? 600? 5 or 600? I think, I think 500, man. I think, I think, I think 500... Or, you know, you're, like, funny, so, you know, you're, like, a 1,500 that lost all their pieces, and... I, I, I don't know, like, that was, that was subpar. Um, Mr., 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 okay, let's, let's go. Let's take a look. That was not good. I think it was a bullet game, though. That, that felt like a bullet game. So, that was a bullet game. Wait, what? 
Wait, I have the wrong game. Wait, I have... <laughs> Wait, I have the wrong game. What is this? Wait, what is going on? What? What is this? Did you link me to another game? What? Bro, what is going on, man? Hold up. What is happening here, man? Wait. You sent me a link... ...to this game, bro. Oh! I copy-pasted the wrong link. That's what happened. Oh, I copy-pasted the wrong link. Here. This is the right game. Alright. That was, yeah, that was, that, that was me being Pepega. That was definitely Pepega. So. Yeah. Okay. 600. 600. Wait. Wait a second. My subscriber said. Playing white. Name Piriosa. They said playing white, name Piriosa. But black is Piriosa in this game. Yo, my subscribers don't even know what color they played in a game they're sending? So which... My subscriber is Piriosa. So Piriosa did this. First of all, Piriosa, stop playing F6. Queen H5 weakens your king. Wait, so Piriosa just took all the pieces. So... This game was so weird. This was like, white was like in a, th this is like, what? Pyrosa? Um, I don't, I don't know. I mean, yeah, I'm proud of my sub. They blundered once, but then they just, I mean, I'm not really, this is a game that I can't really be proud of too much because all black did was take free pieces when available. So he did good, you know. Your opponent decided to start throwing faster than you, basically. I like, one player was winning, but gave it away. Yeah, because on move, uh, you know, two, three, black threw the game away, and then, and then, yeah, so it's, it's called giveaway. Very good. Fantastic.